Hello everyone! Welcome back to my Journey Canada vlog. For today's video, uh, papakita ko sa inyo kung paano pa maghanap ng employer dito sa Canada or paano maghanap ng work uh, ngayon dito sa Canada. Actually, meron akong related uh, video sa channel ko. Yun yung uh, online job search uh, dito sa Canada. So, eto. Uh, check nyo na lang yung sa channel ko. Eh. Related video. So, dito sa <clears throat> gagawin kong video ngayon, papakita ko sa inyo kung paano ba mag uh, job search, mag click and then ano ba yung mga i-check kapag uh, nag-search kayo ng job like descriptions, location dito sa Canada and then if nag accept ba ng foreign worker at uh, temporary foreign workers uh, dito sa Canada yung employer or yung makikita ng uh, masasearch nyo na job so yun, so gaya nga nang sabi ko uh, mostly ngayon kapag nag-hire ng foreign workers, ah, kailangan ng LAMIA or Labor Market Impact Assessment. Prove na last resort lang yung pag-hire ng foreign worker. Walang Canadian na nag apply I hope after this video is makatulong sa inyo to. So, okay guys, so actually in advance ko na yung job search. So ito yung Job Bank Canada. Yung uh, website nyo is yung jobbank.gc.ca. So kahit itype nyo lang yun. Um, Uh, don't forget yung GC or Government of Canada kasi um, mag-error yan or hindi siya magsisearch. Pag ang ginamit nyo is Apple products like sa akin, Safari, uh, hindi niya i-allow. So, make sure na jobbank.gc.ca So, ang jobbank.gc.ca uh, ito yung official uh, uh, website uh, for job search dito sa Canada. So, yan, makikita nyo, pagka nandun na kayo sa official website, Government of Canada, Government to Canada, so French. Alright. And then, isa pang papakita ko sa inyo, so mamaya na tayo mag-job search. Meron pang Indeed. So, ito. Indeed. So, ang Indeed, um, dito ako uh, mismo nakahanap ng employer. Nung nasa farm pa ako sa Ontario. And then, yun, sinwerte, last 2016, and then, Um, may nag-reply, employer na nag-support um, sa akin dito sa Manitoba. So, from Ontario. So, medyo mahaba yung proseso. Uh, yun, interview, bigay ng information, and then in-apply niya ng LMIA, gaya ng sinasabi ko parate, pag nag-apply ng foreign worker, need ng LMIA for uh, other types of jobs. Kasi may mga skilled uh, jobs na LMIA exempted na sa mga hinahire uh, from other countries and kahit yung mga nandito na sa Canada. So, yun. So, specific to my job sa Tim Hortons, um, required ng Lamia. Kipi-flip ko lang yung camera para mas uh, madali nyo makita. Okay, guys. So, I hope uh, nakikita nyo uh, clearly yung sa monitor. So, let's start sa Job Bank uh, Canada. You can just try to click the job search here. I hope kita. Okay. And then, dito, so what? So like, for example, um, factory worker jobs. Kasi may nag-email sa akin uh, kanina ang kapon. Or nag-comment dito sa, sa isang video ko sa channel na may tatanong about sa factory worker jobs. So, let's try for example. Factory worker jobs. Factory worker. And, so, location. Um, kung may specific kayong uh, lugar na gustong or na puntahan or target dito sa Canada. So, you can just type in any provinces, territories. Pero mostly ang mga immigrants <clears throat> nagpupunta sa mga big cities or depende kung may relative sila, mga kaibigan sa ibang province or territories, uh, doon sila. Pero karamihan talaga sa mga big cities like Toronto, Quebec, uh, Calgary, Edmonton, uh, ano pa ba? Vancouver, so yun. Mga uh, laking city mo yun. Winnipeg, uh, minsan, <clears throat> Win kung saan nandito yun sa amin sa Manitoba alright so like for example all of Canada na lang kasi 
mas madali. And then, mas maraming jobs ang mag-a-appear. So, yun. Type natin, factory worker jobs. So, yan, no? Merong plumber, mechanic, helper. Uh, I hope nakikita nyo, guys. Uh, uh, farm laborer, footwear, salesperson, retail. So, heavy equipment mechanic. So, let's cite this one as an example. Itong farm laborer. So, dito pa lang sa yung mga na job search. Uh, farm laborer, for example. Ito yung company, Chips Produce Ltd. or Limited. Ang place niya is Ontario. ON Ontario yan. Kung, na, kung saan nandun yung Ottawa and then Toronto. So, Bradford, Ontario yung lugar. And then, nag appear na kagad yung salary. Uh, per hour is 14.39. So, yan. Dito kasi sa uh, Canada. Ang mga provinces and territories may iba't ibang minimum wage yan. So, parang mm, yun yung gustong gaw implement na federal system sa atin sa Pinas. So, let's try to click this one. Actually, hanap tayo ng iba. I know farm laborer na sab nabanggit ko na yun sa last video kay so hanap tayo ng iba ah. sa mga ah, may FNB work experience food service supervisor so yan sa busy so pizza cook sa British Columbia I mean mm, yung typical na factory worker jobs so, ang nag-appear ah. So, dito sa baba, show more results. Madami yan. Uh, all over Canada na yan. Um, Drywaller, interior design, tomato picker. Mostly mga ano. So, yan, electrician. No? Walang <clears throat> related na ano eh. Parang malapit sa factory worker jobs. Uh, okay. Okay. So, dito na nga lang tayo sa cook. Alright. So, ayan. Sa cook, so pag-click ninyo, so pag-click nyo ng job na hinahanap nyo or specific na related sa work experience nyo, may kita nyo, may check, verified. Okay. Posted on December 27, 2020, Shawash. Ito yung address, Etibicook, Eti Ontario, Ito yung, ano, uh, postal code. Ang hourly minimum wage or per hour rate is $18. So, cook ma part ng skilled jobs kasi yan dito sa Canada. So, mataas talaga rate niyan. $18 per hour, permanent employment full time. So, ito. Yung shift. So, start as up. Two vacancies. Verified job bank. May number pa yan, no? Excuse me. Alright. Job requirements. Language, English. Education. College, Egypt. So, pag outside applicant kayo, nag-apply kayo, kayo dito ng cook. Um, yun. You just have to check sa job description kung paano mag-apply. So, yan. Uh, pwedeng email. And then... Supposed to be may contact dapat to eh. Ayan, show how to apply. So, review muna natin. So, ito, yung specific skills or descriptions. At least with 2 years to less than 3 years experience. Um, cuisine, specialties, work setting, restaurant. Willing to relocate. Okay. Advertise until January 26, 2021. So, ayan, naka-indicate. Alos lahat, specific yan. Hanggang kailan siya nakapost. And then may important notice. This job post has been provided directly by the employer to the job bank. Government of Canada has taken steps to make sure it's accurate and reliable but cannot guarantee its authenticity. Okay, click natin show how to apply. So, yun. So, pag-click nyo nun sa baba nung uh, description. Uh, yan. By email. Pwede kayong mag-apply dyan. 
So, yun lang. Yun lang yung naka-indicate. Or by mail pala. Kaya lang, by mail, mas matagal yan. So, email na lang talaga ang option nyo. Okay. So, yun. Kapag nag-submit kayo ng email dyan, or kung nagbigay silang number, or by mail, nag-send kayo, um, kung talagang interested yung employer sa inyo, you have enough work experience, and then maganda yung uh, background nyo, uh, work experience nga, uh, for sure, uh, kukontakin kayo niyan. Okay, what else? So, gaya nang sabi ko, may ki minsan dito, naka-indicate din sa job description or sa specific job na i-click nyo. May naka-indicate. If nagsusupport sila ng temporary foreign workers. So, for this one, um, the employer promotes equal opportunities for all job applicants, including those self-identifying as a member of these groups. Ah, ito yung equality ng ano to. So, yun. So, for this specific job group, uh, walang naka-indicate if they are accepting temporary foreign workers or may lamia job sila as specific to this job. So, yun. But uh, you can still try to apply. Kasi ang cook naman is under na skilled uh, jobs. So, pwede kayong mag-apply sa express entry. Alright, so let's try another one. So, ito meron luwabas. Cheese factory worker. Itong QC, ano to, uh, uh, province to ng Quebec, dito sa Canada. SK Saskatchewan. So, I'm not sure if marunong kayo mag-French, so you can definitely apply in this province. Uh, if not, I think, kung interested kayo, meron sa Merkan dati yung mga uh, napunta ng Quebec, pinag-aral muna sila ng French, uh, language course for one month para sa mga basic kasi kailangan mo talaga ang <laughs> Quebec is French uh, province ng Canada yan so yeah Ayan. so let's try ang salary is 15.81 for this specific job which is factory worker it's verified full time one year to less than two years experience so, ayan. Willing to relocate. So, ito, yung binabanggit ko kanina about dun sa um, kung nag accept ba ng foreign worker. Yung naunang cook, wala. Pero ito, na pala, naka-advertise siya until January 16 of 2021. So, ito, intended job posting audience. Anyone who can legally work in Canada can apply for this job. If you are not currently authorized to work in Canada, the employer will not consider your job applications. So, <clears throat> eto. Yan, gaya nga nang nasabi ko kanina. Yung iba, meron. Yung iba, wala. nag indicate sila kung nag ba ng foreign worker. So, for this specific job, anyone who can legally work in Canada can apply. So, yung iba, yung may mga open work permit. Pwede sila mag-apply rito na nasa Quebec ngayon or nasa province na gusto mag-move dito, pwede rin. Um, mga permanent residents, of course, Canadian citizens, yes. Um, so, pag nakita nyo yung ganito, um, I just don't mind this one kasi gusto nila yung mga ano, may um, status dito sa Canada. So, sometimes nag indicate sila na may uh, Lamia supported. So, may kita nyo yun dito. Yun. Okay. Okay. I just cite uh, like a few examples. Uh, gusto nyo maghanap na may mga Lamia jobs. Pwede nyo naman i-type Lamia. Uh, Lamia. Let's try that one. Ayan. So, pag tinype nyo yung Lamia, lalabas dyan yung mga jobs um na may Lamia supported na. Oh, so, as of now, ito lang yung merong Lamia supported jobs. So, web developer sa Calgary, Alberta. Chef, Moose Joe, administ administrative assistant. So, let's try this uh, web developer. 
So sa Calgary to permanent employment full time. Verified Lamia jobs. So ayan yung mga specific skills, job descriptions. Uh, di ko na isa-isahin guys. Ha? Pero ang minimum hour is wage 26.44 per hour malaki. So ayan. So like this one. Di na nakindikit dito sa baba. Yun na. Lamia supported. Ando naman sa title niya. So yun. I hope uh, nakatulong ito. Itong job search na to. So this is for the job bank. Uh, .gc.ca So, now let's go to the second job search. Pagkita ko sa inyo. Ayan. Okay. So, ito naman is yung Indeed. Indeed.ca So, ito rin yung... Dito ako nakahanap. So, actually, dalawa yung pinagsisearch yan ko. Job Bank and then Indeed. Last 2016 nga. Nung naganap ako ng work nasa Ontario ko. And then, nag-move ako dito sa Manitoba. So, ito yung... Uh, job search na nakahanap ako talaga ng employer. Alright, so again, dun sa job bank, <clears throat> gaya ng sabi ko, pwede kayo mag-indicate ng place, provinces, territories, kung saan specific location yung gusto mapunta dito sa Canada. And, but, I advise, uh, check nyo na lang yung ano, uh, uh, all places in Canada. Para makita nyo rin yung mga available jobs, kung gaano kadami ma-compare nyo rin yung uh, salary, accommodation, job descriptions, and kung ano pa. Alright. So, dito sa Indeed, so like, for example, um, nagahanap ko yung work sa uh, food and beverage industry. So, like before, nag-search na ako, food counter attendant. Attendant. So, ganyan lang dito sa, ano, so pagkita nyo ng job search, Indeed, dito na kagad ko ng job title. And then, For location, Canada na lang, para all over Canada. Pero kung may idea naman kayo, like for example, kaya gawin na nga lang natin, Alberta. Alberta. Ayan, okay. So pagka-search nyo ng specific job, and then yung place, click nyo lang yung find jobs. Alright, so ayan, mag a na lahat ng jobs uh, related dun sa topic na tinipe nyo. So kagaya nito, food counter attendance sa uh, Leduc, Alberta, and then ang minimum wage 15 to 16 an hour. Ayan, madami yan. So makikita nyo dito. <laughs> Bababa yan. Bilisan ko lang. Hanap tayo ng Tim Hortons kung meron. Arby's, Wendy's, mga Asian restaurant tong ibo. Edo, Japan. Ito, try natin. Sa Westlock, Alberta. So, ayan. So, paano mag-apply? Click nyo lang to. And then, yan. Fill up nyo lang. Choose kayo ng uh, file. Make sure na uh, may ready kayong resume detailed. So, dito sa Canada, kailangan nila detailed resume. So, every work na napasukan nyo, kailangan may job descriptions yun. Tapos, uh, just have to sell yourself. To, uh, bigay nyo na lahat ng best nyo. Uh, any good adjectives and then references. Uh, sama nyo na. Make it short but detailed. Okay. So, yun, at attach additional documents. Mga employment certificate and then Uh, don't forget yung cover letter. Gusto nila may cover letter din dito. So, ayan. Notify. And then, continue. So, that's it. So, ako ganun lang yung ginawa ko nung nag-try ako rito. Last 2016. Nakita niyo yung description. Experience, education, needed. Mga benefits. Ayan. So, job types. Full-time, part-time. 13 to 17 per hour. So, sa akin pa lang nangyari. Uh, hindi ko na chinek yung kung supported ba ng LMIA. Ang ginawa ko, pagka-click ko ng specific job, like ito, food counter attendant, uh, in-email ko lang yung employer sa Manitoba. And then, yun. Ang sakto, may naka-apply na siyang LMIA. Advance kasi na-apply ng employer yun. 
or mag apply pa lang kung meron silang prospect na foreign worker. Kasi ano yun eh, uh, ang processing nun, 3 months to 6 months or more. Kailangan nagpo-post sila online to advertise. Make sure they're buying time to hire a locals or Canadians. Last resort lang kasi talaga dapat ang ano, mga foreign worker. And then, yun, marami yan. So, mag-type tayo ng ano, ano pa bang jobs? Fish processing. So, meron kasi nag-email sa akin sa kabayan natin. Ayan, no. So, fish processing, yan, laborers sa BC and mostly yung mga fish processing plant workers sa Atlantic Canada yan, like Newfoundland and Labrador. Prince Edward Island, New Brunswick, Nova Scotia, to New Brunswick. So, yun. Ganun ulit. Apply lang dito. Click nyo lang. So, yun. Uh, gaya ng sabi ko, uh, uh, tatype nyo lang yung itong job search na to. Jobbank.gc.ca or indeed.ca and so, ganun lang yung pag-search ng uh, specific jobs or related jobs na akma sa inyo. And then, check nyo lang yung job descriptions. And then, uh, kalimitan, hindi nila ini-indicate yung kung supported ba ng Lamia. So, yung nangyari nga sa akin, yung in-email ko directly employer from Ontario dito sa Manitoba. Sakto, minsan kahit hindi naka-indicate dito, meron silang lamiya na ina-apply or naka-pending na. So, sakto, pag nag na ng foreign worker, dire-diretso na yun. So, um, huwag kayong madown kung mga nasa-search na nyo na jobs dito kung nasa other country kayo is walang supported na lamiya. Email nyo lang, kontakin nyo sila, and madalas, yung ibang employer may naka-apply ng lamiya yan. I hope makatulong sa inyo to. Kayang-kaya nyo rin makapunta rito kabayan. And yun, shout out pala tayo guys. So quick shout out na for uh, Jinky Ocampo. So thank you for watching uh, this video. My specific video kung saan ka nag uh, like and then and nag uh, comment. Thank you. Um, Antonio De Los Santos. So ito si Kabayan uh, from Korea. So nagtatanong siya about sa machine operator. So I hope nakatulong yung uh, comment and reply ko sa'yo. So, browse mo lang yung channel ko and for sure, uh, marami kang matututunan. And Angelito Paras. So, ito. Uh, thank you for watching, Kabayan Angelito. Dexter Fabero. Ito si Kabayan. Nandito rin to sa Manitoba sa kabilang taon lang. Nida Cuino. Uh, thank you for watching po. Nagtatanong siya about sa consultant sa Dubai. So, meron akong video uh, na kinoment ko sa kanya ginawang video uh, may kaibigan ako na galing ng Middle East so I think sabi niya pareho lang ang ang process ng mga applicant galing Middle East so sa Dubai lahat ang, ang visa processing center papuntang Canada so, so sister ko si May May so support naman po <laughs> may channel po siya about sa Shih Tzu so panoorin niya and then, K, Kabayang Jumar Malapo. So, ito. So, Kabayang Jumar, so thank you for your comment. I hope uh, nakatulong yung mga reply ko sa'yo. Uh, please continue to support my channel and my videos. Like and share my videos. And subscribe.